Patrick has walked out of the care center. Danica, what is that the hardest hit you've ever taken, and, and how do you feel right now? I don't know. It feels like they're all pretty hard, unfortunately. Um, I think more than anything, I'm just upset that the GoDaddy car felt really good. It was the best car I'd had all speed weeks, and um, seemed like we could catch whoever, and seemed like we could move around and make lanes, help lanes out, and move, move around and move forward at the end of the day. And uh, so I felt like everything was going pretty well, so it's just upsetting, you know. I think it's a sort of culmination of sitting around all day, and, you know. So uh, it's a bummer, but it's, you know, that's kind of the excitement of speedway racing is that anything can happen, and um, it was unfortunate that I was on the short end of the accident, but uh, that's the kind of thing that happens. And, you know, I appreciate everyone sticking around and watching, and we'll go get them at Phoenix. Glad you're okay. Thanks, David. Thanks, Kristen Taylor. Well, here we go. Big crash. Another turn four is Calamity Corner. There's Rookie Reed Sorensen sliding down off the banking. Big damage to the board of Marcus Ambrose, number nine. And caution wave with 38 laps to go. Marcus Ambrose with a bunch of damage there. Seven car. Something, something seemed to, somebody broke loose in the pack. I couldn't tell if there was contact. Rookie Michael Lynette, heavy damage on his pilot Chevy. Marcus Ambrose. And let's have a look. Watch the three of our full center Austin villains. 